Hi, my name is Iken Nonyepelo. I'm a PhD candidate working with Dr. Bashar Ishada on the Safe Car Project. In this presentation, I will highlight some of our results based on assessing the impact of future climate change on rainfed maize production in the region. But first, let's explore the Eastern Kansas River Basin grain season precipitation gradient. As you can see on the screen, the precipitation gradient increases from west to east of the region and may signify varying potential impacts on rainfed crop production, particularly for maize, which I will discuss in a minute. And so based on the based on our result for the baseline period, which is from 1984 to 2014. Average yield values in the region ranges from about 6,000 kg per hectare to slightly over 12,000 kg per hectare. This variation in yield in the region shows a systematic increasing trend from west to east of the region, a trend we found coinciding with the regional precipitation gradient reported previously. We found that the trend impacted regional yield variability as variability measured by coefficient of variation decreases from west to east, signifying that more grain season precipitation maintains its stability and vice versa. In addition, we found that soil variability play a key role in determining the outcome of rainfed yield in the region, with soils of seed loam being the most productive soil in the region, followed by acidic clay loam and then clay loam. Also, we found that climate variables have huge impact on yield in the region. For example, we found that yield decreases with increasing minimum and maximum temperatures and solar radiation. Our result revealed that a one degree Celsius or one megajoule rise in temperature or solar radiation respectively may result in slightly over 2.1 ton per hectare loss of yield in the region. On the other hand, yield increases with increasing grain season precipitation, indicating that a one millimeter rise in precipitation may result in over 0.02 ton per hectare increase in yield. And so future climate deviation relative to baseline period projected temperature increases during the uh, last century, which is from 2071 to 2100, with values ranging from 3.2 to 4.9 degrees C for maximum temperature and 2.3 uh, to 3.7 degrees C for minimum temperature. And finally, minus 60 to minus 102 millimeter for precipitation. And so growing um, you know, maize under this climate condition may result in you know, yield decline ranging from about 36% to 50%, and possibly even shifting the most productive soil from seed loam to seed clay loam to soil textures. And so therefore, in our next step, we will look at you know, the key adaptation strategies to mitigate the impact of future climate change, maize production in the region. Thank you.